Okay, now remember that uh, that key that we picked up in Concord, the Corvega storage key? It opens Ooh, a machine gun. Uh, I'm really tempted, but we don't have much ammo for it. We're going to get a crap ton of machine guns in um, when we do the uh, unlikely Valentine mission. So this is no piggy. Let's just leave that. Oh man, come back! I was having fun. Let's see if we get some more. Uh... Yeah, I'll take those. Why not? Corvega storage key opens up this right here. Lots of ammo in here. This is typically typically the location you come to to complete the mission. The first step. It's highly likely that when we go there and talk to the settlers, they're gonna say. Uh, go down to the Corvega Vega assembly plant and clear out the, the raiders. The only problem is Tim Pines Bluff is way off over here. Right there. Okay? And that's just way out of the way. With no fast travel in this mode, it's just taking us too far off our, you know, and there's not much to do over there. So, we're just gonna have to leave that until Act 2 when we can start, like, you know, using the, uh, Brotherhood of Steel Birdie Birds to get around. And then maybe we'll go back and cash in on that uh, as long as we kill the guy Jared upstairs. Okay, did you get all that? <laughs> It'll be a pop quiz tomorrow. Alright, now, coolant caps. Here we go. In the basement of the Corvega assembly plant, right where I am now, there's a whole bunch of coolant caps here. Each one is worth four aluminum, I believe. Great source of aluminum. I've Collected as many as 22 of these coolant caps in here. Two aluminum. So that's 44 aluminum you can get right there if you pick all these up. Now aluminum is going to be important to repair and mod uh, further versions of power armor. I think T51 and T60. T60 in particular um, is repaired by aluminum and modded by... We're going to be using a lot of aluminum. Uh... I picked these up in practice runs and it just weighed me down so much and I'm pretty confident I'm going to be able to have enough aluminum. I'll tell you what, I'm going to pick them all up now and this the first thing I'm going to dump because each one, if I get overloaded, because each one is worth, weighs one pound. Is some there. Some under the stairs over here. Like it was worn out. There's some here. Some here. And you look around carefully, you maybe get more. Let me see how many I got now. 20. Yes, yeah, so there's at least a couple more that I know of. That could have it easy in it. Does and some bobby pins. Leave that. Okay, let's go upstairs and kill Jared. Oh, there's some fancy lads and some dandy boys. Uh, let me drop some weaponry here. I'm sure I'm. Don't need that. Actually, I want to keep that pipe bottle. That goes out. This is a better squirt, the tactical pipe bottle. Yeah, I'm getting pretty heavy already. Okay, once again we gotta fight for our bed. I 
up to the main assembly line. That's where the boss quote end quote is. He's right over there up on top of this like elevated office area right over there. So we're going to sneak down this side here. Take out some spotlights. Try to work on a couple of turrets or two. Okay, that spotlight goes out. It's right, right there. Thirsty. Almost psycho. Some cover fire of it. Do this, metal man. Oh man, come back. I was having fun. Shit. Awesome. Got him. And one second, please. Gotta answer the phone. Okay, I'm back. Well, oh. Yeah. Okay, you got a turret up there. There's the turret right there. Got it. Great. Okay, calling all raiders. Back it in, boys. There's nothing out there. <laughs> yeah, that's right. He's gone home. Here we go. Yeah. Down you go. Off with your head. I just love that shit. Okay, where's that light? Great. Okay, Jared's down. What's your story? 38 stim pack. Take the pipe pistol. Leave the rest of the shit. Uh, we got another light here. There's still a turret there. Oh, I see a guy right there. Do that again. Come on. Bring it. Come on. Uh-oh. This car's gonna blow. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, dude! Oh, oh man! <laughs> oh, shit! Wow. Shit blowing up here, boss! Damn, what a way to go. My power or my fusion core is about to run out. I gotta save it. It's at zero, just in time. Sweet. How's that for running down a fusion core? <laughs> Let me just check something here. I've never run one down to zero. Fifty. I should have put the one at fifty in. Yeah, see? Still worth two hundred caps. The fuck was that? The hell was that? Okay, so I believe those guys are up above me there. Let me just get around here. I don't want to get tra trapped in here. I also want to do in that late. For me, not even possible. <laughs> Getting shook up over nothing. Where is that light? What the? I'm trapped here. <laughs> yeah, that's nothing. Here you go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on out. Atta boy. Yeah. 
Who is your daddy? Let me hear it. Slack daddy. That's right. Okay, the bed's in here. We can get the key to us. Here's a, a med box. Let me see if I can save the game. If I can, I'm going to call it a run. I can. That's a run. <laughs> and I got parasites from sleeping in this dirty mattress. Uh-oh. Okay, I'm going to call it, a run, call it a run, rather. Um, thanks a lot for watching. See you next video when we finish off the Corvega assembly plant. We're going to go up top and grab the repair bobblehead, which will make our fusion cores last a lot longer. That's one of the main reasons we're here, along with collecting a whole bunch of 38 cal ammo. Right? Thanks a lot for watching. See you next video.